breaking news. Breaking right now, hitting the brakes on the orange line. Hundreds of thousands of T-riders could be stranded if the MBTA moves ahead with this drastic plan to fix safety issues. WBZI team sources say the T is planning a month-long shutdown of the orange line. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Lisa Hughes. And I'm David Wade. This 30 days is needed to make some much-needed repairs. Let's get right to Christina Rex. She's live in Medford tonight with the details that were just uncovered by the I-team. Christina? Yeah, Lisa and David, the MBTA Board of Directors is having an emergency meeting tomorrow morning to discuss this potential plan, which would mean shutting down the Orange Line completely for up to 30 days for critical maintenance. Now, an estimated 200,000 people take these Orange Line trains every day, and if this plan goes through, they'll have to take shuttle buses instead. New trains on old tracks. Sources tell WBZ's I team the MBTA is considering a month long shutdown to fix the orange line. Oh, that's a lot of shuttle buses. <laughs> Indeed it is, enough to cart roughly 200,000 people a day. I mean, I guess I completely get it, but at the same time, that's people's way of getting around and getting to work. Riders are worried how this potential plan will impact their commute. I just graduated high school, but I was doing an early college program, so I take that to get to Bunker Hill. So I'm just like, that's multiple trips. I don't know how I would get anywhere. They should just overhaul the whole thing. This possible fix comes as the Federal Transit Administration is overseeing the T's safety plan after several recent issues, including rollaway trains and a fire over the Mystic River that forced passengers to jump from the windows. The Orange Line tracks in particular have enough wear and tear that there's a mandatory slow zone the trains ride through each day, lengthening the commute. We're at the point with the T that we can't keep kicking the can down the road anymore. Boston Mayor Michelle Wu reacts to the news of a potential Orange Line closure and says if it happens, it better be worth it and make a real improvement in train service. Any disruption in service needs to have alternatives that would involve either shuttle buses or other options and that's where the city could be a real partner. So we would look to work very closely with the MBTA and provide any support if this is to happen. And Governor Baker has a news conference planned with the general manager of the MBTA. That's scheduled for 1230 tomorrow following that board meeting. For now, live in Medford, Christina Rex, WBZ News. Christina, thank you.